This morning, you might see and smell smoke. We've been talking all about it this morning. Unfortunately, the wildfires on the West Coast continue to impact the air quality in some parts of our state. Eyewitness News reporter Roger Susannon is live in Broom Bloomfield this morning, and he can tell us what it's like there. So, Roger, can you smell it? Yeah, good morning, Wendell. Good morning, Nicole. Yes, you absolutely can smell it. I would say it actually kind of reeks right now. It smells, I would say, like a combination of a campfire mixed with burning plastic. So again, not a great scent out here. It's also not a great sight out here. You can see a little bit of the haze that is still filling the sky right here in Bloomfield and really across so much of Connecticut. Later today, the Wood Human Services Center here in Bloomfield is going to open up so that people can kind of escape this lousy air quality along with the heat. And people have actually been calling 911 in this area of the state because they can see and smell the smoke. But again, this is all tied to the western wildfires. And really to give you a better view of this situation, Take a look right now at our eye camera above Rocky Hill. These are live images right now. You can see the haze right now that is developing over the Hartford skyline. And, you know, the western wildfires have really had a big impact in our state over the last several days, starting yesterday, actually. It's a kind of a surreal sight, but experts say if you suffer from respiratory issues, you should be really careful and stay inside as much as you can. And Deep actually advises everyone to avoid strenuous outdoor activities like running. Now, last night, the haze affected huge swaths of our state. This was the scene in Torrington. As you can see, the smoke affected the views of the uh, surrounding forest there. Quinnipiac University professor Dr. Robert Hansen says, we've seen certainly hazy days like this before, but not to this extent. He did warn us that because of the severity of these wildfires, this could be a persistent problem. I think we're going to see this again. The magnitude of wildfires is much greater. So all that smoke is being produced out west and it's getting transported to uh, Connecticut. And if you want to beat the heat and the lousy air quality here in Bloomfield, remember the Wood Human Services Center opens up at 9 o'clock this morning. You do have to bring your face mask with you. Reporting live in Bloomfield, I'm Roger Suzanne in Channel 3 Eyewitness News.